the EMAR project, facilitating information exchange for efficient, safe and environmentally friendly maritime operations. The EMAR project supports DG Move with a specific focus on the EU e-maritime initiative. 27 partners from 13 member states are working together to establish a common and efficient way for acquiring, handling and sharing essential data. Today, there is a wide variety of system architectures, data formats, software systems and sensing and safety devices in use in the maritime sector. This makes cooperation and optimization practically impossible. The EMAR connectivity infrastructure replaces the current maze of communication channels with seamless information flows across transport chains and business networks. In EMAR, the connectivity infrastructure is being applied in the maritime single window developments, implementing Directive 201065 on reporting formalities. The unique value propositions of the EMAR project are the common reporting schema, the EMAR access points, web services for integration with industry applications such as import control systems, and the single window building blocks. The Common Reporting Schema, or CRS, provides a single, standardised document for all reporting requirements to authorities in all member states. It allows the alignment of regulatory and standardisation developments whilst ensuring that users can report the right information at the right time. The Common Reporting Schema is transmitted using the EMAR access points. The access points provide secure and efficient information exchange and so could strengthen the key role played by SafeCNet in coordinating information exchange between member states using agreed standard messages. The key requirement from industry is a standardised reporting interface for shipping companies, independent of the port of call. A common maritime single window architecture is being investigated in EMAR with the Norwegian Coastal Administration. This will be an agreed design specification consisting of common single window building blocks so that member states can construct their own solutions from existing systems and selected added components. Experience in developing and deploying single windows has been gained in the eFreight project through the implementation of a next generation multimodal single window testbed in Latvia. The testing and learning process continues in the EMAR project with a pilot study in Norway. This study is concentrating on developing single window building blocks and testing the solutions with users to ensure that practical benefits are feasible and innovation is focused on maximising usability and maintainability of new solutions. Support for member states is available to develop solutions following a seven-step methodology, starting with describing their existing situation and then specifying a desired future architecture, including modules to be reused and existing systems to be integrated. The EMAR team at BMT Group and Inlacom has gained extensive knowledge and experience over the past few years in the technical issues and human factors that affect a successful maritime single window implementation. Cooperation with users and experts in different fields is the key to success.